So people want to know, how do you export your connections on LinkedIn? As you can see here, I have quite a few connections. You click on my network and you will see that I have 15,712 connections. I have 4,304 people waiting to connect with me. So if I click on my connections, you see I have a whole list of connections, but the question is how do you download them? I want to be able to see them all at once on a spreadsheet. So the way to do that is to click on the me link over here, and then you click on settings and privacy. That should open up a new tab, which is linkedin.com slash p settings, like personal settings. Then under the privacy tab, you scroll down till you see download your data. You see it says here download your data. You click on download your data. Then you can choose all your data or you could just choose a certain type amount of data. So we're going to just do the connections here so it goes a little faster. And then you press request archive and it says your download will be ready in 10 minutes. When you press request archive, it will ask you for your password. So you literally just put in your password and you press done. Then what happens is LinkedIn will show that it's download pending. When it finishes download pending, you can refresh this page. You'll get an email when it's ready, but you can just refresh this page in two to three minutes, depending on how many connections you have, and you'll be able to download the file as a CSV file. Keep in mind that I like to download all my stuff every single month. Why? Because maybe your account will get banned, and then you're not going to have access to your articles and all your information and your messages and your recommendations and so on. So you want to make sure that you do an export every once in a while. So now it says download archive. It took about 15 minutes or so. It says 10 minutes, so it take 15 minutes. I click on download archive, and then the download begins. Once it gets downloaded, you'll see a zip file called connections.zip, and then inside you'll see connections.csv. So you double click on this, and it opens up in Excel, and you can easily see all your connections right here. Now the thing is, LinkedIn used to include email addresses. It no longer includes email addresses, so you can actually see first name, last name, company name, position, first name, last name, email for the people that include emails, but it's going to be by default off on most people these days. Uh, company position and connected on date. And that's basically it. I highly recommend you go through this and you look at who you know and who you don't know and build relationships with people. Um, if you want to get their emails manually, all you got to do is go to their profile page copy their username copy their thing and over there usually people can show their emails it just doesn't get included in the export hopefully this was helpful on how to do this um, in future videos I will show you how to turn this into a pivot table so that you can break down how many different types of CEOs and how many people at certain companies are you're connected at and so on and so forth thank you very much